<laughs> Happy Halloween, anybody watching live? It is currently October 31st, a.k.a. Halloween, which means there's a Halloween event going on in Mortal Kombat, but the scariest part of it is right here on the left, as you can see. That is the seasonal fatality, the first of many, I'm sure. Uh, happy Halloween fatality at a price of a cool, crisp 12,000 dragon coins, which uh, basically equals $12 USD. Didn't they do a whole thing about how, uh, you know, a full price game isn't going to have any uh, monetary rewards? Didn't they say that? Now, uh, this has been a big controversy, and I agree with most of it. But I want to add my uh, little thought process and input to this, um, since I'm I'm huge fan of NRS games and Mortal Kombat. I cannot support this. I cannot back this in any way. I think this is egregious. I think it's disgusting. I feel like having the Deadly Alliance Scorpion skin is... A, there's a difference between these two things here. This Deadly Alliance Scorpion skin is really cool. He's got the flaming head. You get all the pallets. All of this for the price of $10. I think that's fine because it doesn't affect gameplay in any Anyway, it just makes you look cool. If this is what they want to charge real money for, I'm okay with that. It does not affect me personally at all. Like, this is a player decision whether you want to spend your money on the skin or not. I have not done that. I don't play Scorpion. I do think the skin is really cool. Uh, but this fatality is a different story because it requires a player input. Therefore, it's technically related to gameplay. So anything that's locked to gameplay should not cost any money. Speaking of which, there's other DLC in other fighting games, and you have to match it up with that pricing, dude. $12 is more expensive than a single character in Street Fighter VI. Uh, it's more expensive than three characters in any other Mortal Kombat game. So, you're telling me that this one fatality is monetarily worth the same price as a entire DLC for another video game. $12? This game is a, this is a full price game. This is not okay, NRS. You cannot do this. This is unacceptable. It's not okay. Nobody's buying this shit. Literally, nobody is going to buy this shit. And here's why. Uh, the only way to earn dragon coins in this game is to go through mastery, which takes forever. You have to fully master all your characters. And uh, it takes forever. It took me like almost a full month to uh, completely master Shao Kahn. Anyway, today we're going to play the spooky characters, since it is Halloween. <laughs> There's fucking spiders inside of this. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm not joking. I, uh, I, found, I found my Halloween clown mask, and there was literally a spider inside of it. I was like, bro, it's a new kind of nightmare right there. We're going to play Havoc with Goro today. That is the plan for all stream long. Because these are the creepiest characters I can think of. And the only ones that I know well enough. Like, Melina's creepy and spooky, but I don't, I don't really know Melina. So a really cool thing we were talking about the other day with Havoc is uh, if you do back to Goro assist, it restands, and I feel like it's not supposed to do that. This feels like a bug that they haven't noticed. Because if this hits you, uh, can I do it twice in a row? 
No, because he's on cooldown, right? But I can do that, which feels dirty. You can't wake up against Goro Havoc, because I'm coming at you with this. What's really cool, too, is uh, doing that on block in the corner. Doing a torso spin into Goro in the corner. Because he comes out at the same time. So this is just doing insane amounts of chip damage. Like, if you block this shit, the amount of chip damage out of this is broken. <laughs> Character Havoc is crazy. He's got that, and then he's got that option, and then he can do overhead into Goro punch walk, he can do low into punch walk, he can do a uh, forward one two into punch walk, he can do torso spin into Goro, he can do B and B into Goro. I feel like there's more here with this. Uh, like, there's more in here. It might be that. But it's, like, hard to double juggle with Goro with Havoc. For some reason, he, like... He, like, resets himself at the wrong time. Like, this is easier to do with, uh, Sub-Zero. Yeah, it's like, as soon as you do the Goro, he's negative on hit. But not when he's standing, only in juggle. It, it's weird. It feels like they designed it that way. Like, I can do that. I could probably do 2 2 spin, right? You can't wake up there at all. I could probably do this at the end. Oh, wait. I can do one, one, two, Goro. That's kind of spicy. I wish I could follow it up, but I'm pressing bus buttons and. Yeah, nothing's happening. Nothing's happening there. So, I don't know, man. I feel like Goro in combo is like a one-time thing. And that breaks the tether, so it's like the opposite of what you want to do with Havoc. Although... Uh... Yeah, I don't know. Although I would say his mid combos are really cool. What do we want? We want uh, reset at the center. Or I guess something like, what was I doing before with him? I think I was doing forward one Goro after this. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't come out though, it's weird. And the doing 2-2 two -two changes it. 2-2 two -two back throw changes the speed and recovery time. So I can't, like, jump. I can't roll grab here either. It's really difficult to combo off Agora with Havoc. But then you get stuff like that, which I think is really cool. Like, if you land that online, I think that's really cool. 
I feel like what you should use Goro for with the uh, Havoc is this. Uh, or I mean... This, right? Or just go into straight spin, if that works. Do that. Uh, B and B punch walk, because they're gonna be blocking here, or they're gonna try to punish you and they can't. So I feel like this is actually really good. And then they're full. If they if this hits, they're full screen. If it doesn't, they're getting chipped. And then you probably can follow it up with projectile. Uh, Havoc's difficulty is like. A 7 out of 10. But his fun level is like a 10 out of 10. You know what I mean? Like, he's super difficult to actually, like... Even this B and B. Even his base B and B here into Meter Burn Tether is, uh... Really difficult. But he's super fun to play. See, I feel like I can do Goro there. Like, do this. Or maybe. How do you get him to go further back? Down? That's the unblocking. It. I mean, that's still kind of dirty, though, with Havoc, because this... You do this. You set up the unblockable with him. Hit the launch. That's not going to work. So I need to practice... Uh, after special launcher. What is the arm rip? I don't know what he called. What does he actually call this? Helping hand? I just call it arm rip. This launcher. See, I can't hold the cameo. I don't think back two's gonna work. Back ones, or forward ones, usually the way to go. I feel like we can do forward ones. So... This is what I need to practice. You think I can back two? Uh, you know what? After tether, since back two is broken right now, that's not gonna work. Uh. Maybe do that. Full restand. It kind of scales it, which it's. I think it's supposed to scale the damage here. It kind of scales your damage after tether. That's a lot of damage, man. That sends them back full screen, so you can do that stuff. I kind of wonder if I can convert off of this. 
right? Like convert convert up a head rip here. It's gonna depend on I can, it's gonna depend on range and timing. Cause this the timing on this and converting into it is really difficult. Like it doesn't look difficult, but it, it's just so weird. Like this whole character is just so weird. Everything about him. The fact that this projectile bounces on hit as a mid is so awkward. Uh, what's his what's his jump kick like combo here? Just forward one two three. I felt like he had a. He had, I thought he had something else. Is it just two four that I'm looking for? Yeah, it's just two four. I feel like that's really plus for some reason. It is. Why is that so plus on hit? Because you're not opting to juggle. Ugh. So I, that's the hardest part about it is I can't hold cameo and it's like a bad habit that I gotta get rid of here. Almost. Why does that do that on hit? <laughs> See what I mean? There's some weird things about this. Like that was a full free refan. For no reason. That's so dangerous, dude. Because if that shit hits you... I'm like still plus. It makes no sense. Why is this a restamp? Because guess what I get? Roll grab into tether. And then you're going into the blender of like 30% every every time I touch you. Every time, every time we touch. Here's my rewards for hitting uh, the rank, right? Is that what these are? I just hit demigod in ranked. I was playing all weekend long. I was playing ranked all weekend. Every time we touch, do 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 do. My heart keeps beating. Dun, 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 dun. Happy. Okay. So yeah, we want to use Goro for the for the restand shit, and then punch walk for chip damage, basically, and try not to get the stomp to come out. Okay, we've made a mistake. I did not duck. Oh! 
So that cancels out my projectile. That's a super bad trade for me. So I can't use projectiles against Scorpion at all. Chip him out. Round two. Fight. Can't projectile. <laughs> he didn't like it. He didn't like just sitting there and taking the plus frames. <laughs> I mean, Havoc's really good right now. <laughs> I learned something, though. I cannot projectile at all in that matchup whatsoever. I'll just get eaten alive for it. I took like a 40% combo for trying to throw out a fireball. <laughs> Ain't no better way to start a stream than with a quitality win. He did not like what was happening there. He wasn't blocking much of it either. And it doesn't matter. Even if you do block it, it's so uh, much ship damage. I hope they buff it. I want more. I want more. Havoc should be stronger. Since he's so difficult to use. Smoke. But he's got so many options, and all of them are really cool. We talked about it before, but uh, if you're here to see huge combos, this is not the character for that. This is a character that does a small combo that's supposed to lead into another small combo. Oh god. I jumped directly into that, didn't I? Good punish. An overhead. See through the case. Round two. Fight. <laughs> You would have thought I had armor, but you would think wrong. Is this going to scale at all, or am I actually dead? Because this is uh, way too much damage, dude. Nope, I'm actually dead. That was like a 55% combo into Vatable. Finish him! The smoke is scary. Hmm. 
And Scorpion gives them so much combo potential. Why does that lead into a full combo too? Like what? Like the game just started. He went through armor. Cool. Round two. Fight. He goes through the projectile, too. I don't really see how I win this match. It's like an uphill battle every sense of the way. Every step of the way, every sense of the way. Yeah, that just teleports through Gora. I can't do wake up spin at all, apparently. Yeah, it, it breaks meter, it breaks armor. Even as one hit, like low. Havoc's armor got nerfed, I'm hearing. That's stupid, if that's true. Because, uh, that's like the thing that was really good that he kind of needs. I don't know why you would nerf that. I don't think anyone complained about it. I feel like people understood why he had three hits of armor. So he has no, that's he has one option on wake up. He rips off his arm, clocks you over the head. It's not even a. Uh, Like, on Wake Up, it's a hard knockdown. But when you're normally standing, Meter Burn is a stagger. It's weird. It's the weirdest move in the game. Because no meter, it juggles. It's so hard to explain that move to people. Because it does the opposite of what uh, you would think it would do. Like, you should spend the meter for the juggle. Because that's the thing that leads to the most amount of Shang damage. Song's laboratory. You are as bad as Saito's oppressors. I am the best boss in Hollywood. Okay? People love me. Round one. Fight. <laughs> Yep, everything breaks. Okay, so everything breaks armor now. Even that. Everything breaks armor now. So there's no defensive options. Cool. Ah, oh, my balls. What? Oh, that's so unfortunate. I don't know why that dropped, but that absolutely sucks for me. Oh, 
Uh, that went over him. I wonder if I roll grab there, if that would have worked. No jumpies. He likes to block. That is what we've learned. Where'd you go? Imagine losing as the best character in the game. I fought so many Johnny Cages that I know how to play against Johnny Cage. Unfortunately, I still think he is a mile ahead of everybody else in the game. It's not even funny. I, I can't believe he didn't get nerfed. I don't understand how every other top tier character got nerfed except for Johnny Cage. It's weird. It's very strange. Maybe they want him to be the best character? Which seems wrong. Like, I think Liu Kang... They should buff Liu Kang. Liu Kang should be the best. Since he is, like, the main character in the story and stuff. In this new realm of Mortal Kombat 1 being, like, rebooted again for the seventh time. Or whatever the hell. It's gotta be Liu Kang, man. Which is funny. Because, in my opinion, Liu Kang was the best in Mortal Kombat 11. Like, gameplay-wise, uh, tier list-wise, Liu Kang is the best in Mortal Kombat 11. It's closer, though. It's not like he's so... It's not like he's, like, you know... He's not at Johnny Cage's level in this game. And MKX, there's a... It's... It's a tough call between, uh... Relentless Jason, Acidic Alien, and... Was it Pyrotechnic Tanya or whatever? Is still really strong. I don't Great. think she's like the best anymore. I think, uh. Jack Scoro. Yeah, Jason is just so broken in MKX. The gateway. Your uprising is killing innocent And then MK9 sightings. is like, innocent. it's smoke. <laughs> it's smoke. It's the, smoke is the best, and he's been the best, Round and it'll one. probably always Fight. be the best forever. All right, we're in the blender. Let's go. That breaks my armor. That's fair. That breaks the tether. Shall we go again? Why? Round two. Fight. Oh, fuck this. Fuck this matchup. Holy shit. I can't do anything. 
Fuck this matchup. What is this? Is it an N.O. matchup? It is. I can't do anything on Wake Up. Oh my god. Fuck that matchup. What is that? Ah, oh, that's a quitality on my end because what the fuck, dude? He breaks tether meterless? Fuck that. The electric fly breaks tether meterless. Fuck you. Who designed that? I didn't know that until just now. Now I know. Now it's like, okay, you can't pick Havoc against Raiden ever. Electric shock breaks... Uh, what is it? Storm shell? Storm shell breaks all my wake up potential? Why? Why would they nerf my armor? I need it. I need it. I'm not a pressure character. I need wake up, dude. How does Darius work with Kung Lao? Can he interrupt the grab to restand? I wonder. Okay. Sorry, what? Keep. He can poke through. Okay. So I have no armor, so I need to just play like I have no armor. I wish I had armor. Okay. This is a fun game now, huh? Havoc has no options. Cool. Fun, fun, fun. Round one. Fight. He neutral duck. Like he know he knew what was coming, but that's the first time I tried it. This guy either is cheating or knows the matchup.
Or just got like super fucking lucky, huh? Huh? I grab through plus frames. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like this guy is skipping frame data. Like, he actually grabbed through plus frames. Like, that's kind of, uh, crazy. Like, you don't even have the recovery time to do that. Because it's like an auto-response thing. How embarrassing. Yeah, I don't know. Mm. Yeah. I think so. Because look at this. It's a private account. And what do we know about private accounts? And it's locked. Look, the screen is locked. So you can't back out. It's cool, man. When you jailbreak your PS5 to boost frame rate. It's weird. Why do you have to cheat in a fighting game? Just beat me. Just win! Mortal Kombat just tweeted and it had nothing to do with an update of the game. What is going on? Treasure chamber. An effective army needs structure and discipline. It needs fighters willing to die for freedom. <laughs> Yeah, so Mortal Kombat literally just tweeted about, like, trick-or-treating. It had nothing to do with the game, quality of life updates. Kind of pisses me off. Round two. Fight. Yeah. 
Final round, fight! <laughs> What is that damage? I'm sorry, what? Did he just hit me for 50% damage? I thought they nerfed that. Sorry, sorry, what? Everyone saw that, right? He did like the restand into Darius and it did like 51%. And then he left. Okay. Huh? I don't understand. I don't understand this game. I don't understand this game because, <laughs> man, this is the t this is the tweet from Mortal Kombat today. It says group costumes for trick or treaters deserve king size candy bars. We don't make the rules. What does this have to do with anything? What does this have to do with the game, dude? This is like the opposite of communication with your fucking community. What the fuck is this? This has nothing to do with anything. This is meaningless. It's empty words. Like, where are the quality of life updates that you fucking promised in the first month of the game? It's the first month of the game. It's unacceptable, man. It like actually is pissing me off lately. Cause I wanna, I wanna like the game, but more and more shit keeps happening to to the point where I like can't. I want to. I want to enjoy Mortal Kombat. It sucks. It sucks that they don't give a fuck. Like, the game came out unfinished. That's fine if you fucking talk about it and you're like, hey, we're working on it. Here's the dates. But they didn't do any of that. They were like, eh, have fun. Twelve That'll be another $12. You were kind of already juggled, and I don't really know how you got juggled off of nothing. I didn't really do anything. Not good. Go back in there. 
Oh my god. Oh, you can't press the button there. I'm just, it's like personally just frustrating when something you care about, the people that make it don't care about it. I feel like the dev team from NRS should be responsible for some of these things because some of these things are related to quality of life, which is like QA basics, dude. Stuff like in when you play in ranked, your first option is friendly rematch. Why? That's like the worst decision I've ever seen. It makes no sense. Nobody wants to do it. And I can't tell you how many times I've accidentally done it because it's the first option and you're instinct you're instinctively when you're in ranked you just press the button to like go to the next opponent because that's the way it's been for every fighting game ever except for this one <laughs> and you're like oh what's the difference you just wait and press down and then it's the next option that takes one extra second it takes time to avoid doing a thing that nobody wants nobody wants to do a friendly rematch in ranked nobody's doing that no, but I promise you, it's never happening. Unless you run into somebody you know personally. Like, if I run into somebody I recognize, yeah, I'll do it. But other than that, no. It's ranked, man. The point is to play to win. Like, where is Wi-Fi filter? There's a rule in the pro comp about Wi-Fi filter. That's low. But there's no Wi-Fi filter in the... Why is that? The fact that that breaks meter. Nope. I'm learning the gears match up a little bit though. Like I know what I have to do. I know most of it. Most of his shit comes off of a uh, low. Oh, what the fuck? 
That feels unfair. That was my whole combo setup. He just went, I, I launched him into my full combo and he fucking went back in time. That feels unfair. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> That's so dumb. I mean, it's cool. Like, the mechanic of it is cool. But what the hell? It was worth a try. Round two. Fight. It just breaks through everything. <laughs> Running away. Fatality. Okay. And I can't really trade the projectile because his low is fast. guy does not want to play. He wants to stay away. Round two. Fight. <laughs> Take the round, thank you. Final round, fight.
Am I dead? No way, I'm not dead, right? I had like 40 HP. I'm not dead. I'm at like 1% or something. Maybe even, yeah, I'm like at 5% here. Yeah, I'm dead. Fatal didn't work. Not sure why. Might have been a range thing. Oh, it's go Goros is close, isn't it? Shit, I was far away. Goros is like right in your face. That's my bad. I forgot about it until I thought about it for a second. Yeah, I was trying to do the cameo fatal. With Goro, you have to be like standing directly in front of them. It seems like people can just neutral duck the low grab on Goro, which makes no sense. It's like the. Like what? Isn't that the point? Is that it's a low grab? I guess it doesn't work the same way as Shiva's. Shiva's in MK11 is crazy good. Havoc. Havoc. This is where you pick your character. Havoc. Bro, I got a stream to do. What are you doing? I want to play. Frost, Goro, Ying Fortress. Why did you come to Earthrealm, Havoc? <laughs> to wipe the slate clean. To wipe my ass. I've come to chew bubblegum and kick ass, and I'm all out of ass. I dropped my B and B. But it's okay. Cause my wake up saved me. Round two. Fight. Come this way. You bitch. Oh no. Whatever. <laughs> Finish him. 
Why is it not working? Didn't I buy fatals? Didn't I buy the easy fatals? I should have, like, a bunch of them. Yeah, I have, like, 20. Round one. Fight. Oh. Okay. Lame. I'm way over here. What the hell? That wasn't gonna reach. We both know that wasn't gonna reach. Did you think I was gonna roll grab into it? Son of a bitch. Absurd. I'm dead. Finish him. How come he gets to do a fatality, but when I tried to do a fatality, it didn't work? There's a huge gap after 2-2. Two, two. I cannot spin. I have to go into my, my bullshits. You can't spin after back 2-2, two, two, huh? I mean, you can, but there's a gap. It's unsafe to do so. <sighs> On your time, man. Or not. This guy's been like AFK in the menu. I just want to play the game. I would love to do back 2-2 two two into Goro throw, but I don't think I can combo after it. And if I can, I don't know how.
It says connecting match. That should be a good thing, right? H2O. Water's best. Baraka, Hath, Goro, this guy is still using the top tiers? You're still using Baraka Cyrax? Is it working out for you? Freedom, after you partner with Shang Tsung, never. Yeah, I don't think Goro is the best cameo for Havoc. Definitely not. But it does work. Ouch. Why didn't you use him? What? What the lag? Oh my god, you're an idiot. <laughs> you could have killed me and you didn't. That was another lifetime. Final round. Fight. Go that way. Thank you. Stay there. I feel like your bad internet is uh, hurting you instead of helping you like you think it is. If I can't do the fatality, I'll just do the brutality. <laughs> Round one. Fight! Oh. Yeah, that's still a lot of damage. Chipped out on block. Round two. Fight. He won't respect the wake up. Told you.
He doesn't respect Blink Up. At all. I was, uh, lagging here. Into this fatal. What is your ping at? Oh, my couch is in the way. What does this say? It said something. Couch is in the way. Can't really move my couch. The ping is right there. Behind my head. And they put it in the worst place. Round one. It's like sometimes he's at 70, and then there's random spikes to like a hundred something. Like it's bad, dude. Why don't you just block that? Round two. Fight. Nope. This game. Finish him. It, uh, dude, what? It's like not, <laughs> it's not worth it. <laughs> I usually never have problems with it working. I don't know. I just can't do the can't do Goro's fatal. Having connection issues on my phone. I want maybe it's me. Maybe I'm lagging. Halloween's almost over here. I think they only do it for about two hours in my town. They did a parade like last Friday, right before the weekend. There was a parade in town. I didn't see it, but I people told me it was happening. And uh, then we did trick-or-treating for like two hours, and that's about it. It's not really that big of a deal here. I've never once had a trick-or-treater at my house because I'm in the middle of the woods. Hee-hee-hee. <laughs> Johnny Cage. Goro. Ring, 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 Shall we let slip the dogs of war? I'm gonna make you cry. It seems like a lot of people know what to do against Goro Throw, so I never get to use it. It sucks. Oh. 
all that learning Goro throw just to have people like block it. Seems weird. Person low pokes after everything. Which is kind of cute. Final round. Touching a single button. What the fuck? It's a parry. I didn't touch a button. Ha. Ah. Okay. This person gets away with that low poke all the time because they have a private account. I knew they would. I checked it and they did. I wish it would show that. I understand why Sony won't let you guys see it. It's the person's profile, but there was nothing there because it's locked in private. Welcome to fighting games in 2023. Nothing's changed. Nothing has changed. Apparently, Johnny's low poke, uh, after everything is just super safe. Even if you're like a mile away. Like he was doing it on Wake Up, he was doing it on Punish. Motaro? For what, the teleport? Cage Mansion. You don't take me seriously. Let's see if he knows about, like, I mean, I'm assuming he knows the shield is there, right? But he didn't use it. Like, he's, he doesn't use the shield, which means he, he uses Mataro for something else that he hasn't used yet. Like the teleport. Oh, this character's so broken. 
<laughs> oh my god. What? Meet Hollywood's newest star. He lagged. Uh, every Johnny Cage is like just super laggy. It's it's like the new Scorpion thing. Fatality. Johnny Cage wins. It used to be people would just play Scorpion because he was the easiest character. Now people are playing Johnny Cage with like the worst internet. This is the same story, just the character got switched. Fuck you. I'll just punch you in the head. Round two. Fight. Yeah, it doesn't use the shield to reflect any of this shit. Maybe I should just move so you guys can see the ping. Because I know it's bouncing up and down and I feel it. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it, but I can feel the lag coming and going. He just uses it for the multi shot. That's baldy, I like it. Garo hit him after the bell. Round two. Fight. We're breaking rules. Up. Okay. Yeah, I had uh I had armor 
and about 15% health, and that one move killed me. It's a very balanced video game. Yeah, body torso is supposed to have armor, but it feels like it doesn't on startup. What the hell was that lag? What are you do dude, stop! What are you doing? Oh my god, he neutral duck. Oh my god. So one time I go for the grab instead of the low. <sighs> Your internet's getting worse. It's lagging during my grab. Dude. Alright. Holy fuck. It went to like 400. Jesus Christ. Can we get Wi-Fi filter? Please? NRS? Like, I know you're busy making joke tweets about trick-or-treat while also charging people $12 for a fatality, but if you could stop doing that bullshit and start, like, actually making the game playable online, that'd be really cool. That'd be really, really cool. I'd appreciate it. Yeah, I want to start with uh, the throw combo. But it hasn't been working. People just immediately, like, neutral duck it, and then I got full punished every time. So it's like, it's not even worth doing. 
Because it feels like the low starter is the only thing I can really combo off of. I mean, I know there's other options, but they're just really awkward for Havoc. Havoc. Oh no. What is this? Havoc. Oh. Oh no. Oh my god. How is it getting worse? Dude, this, it, it feels like it's frozen on that person's end. Havoc. It won't let me out. It won't let me back out. Thank you. That was like a thousand ping. Can we get Wi-Fi filter? What's the active player count? That's a good question. It's Halloween. I feel like some people will be playing for the uh, Halloween Mesa, which I'm not going to do. Because it sucks. Um, active player count. Uh, 4,600. That's a lot better than I thought it would be. That's really low, but that's, that's better than I thought it would be. 4,600 people are playing online right now. According to, uh, this website, which is very accurate. I believe it. I believe those numbers. That's higher than it was before. Which kind of makes sense, because, like I said, most people are going to be playing for the, uh, the seasonal stuff. But there's not even that much shit to do. There's like one thing to do. Uh, Kano fucks me up, dude. Kano makes this matchup so hard. What are you doing? Please! He keeps changing his cameo. Please! He changed his mind twice. Ah. 
Oh boy. Oh wow, that went through the armor. There was a weird gap there. Round two. Fight. Oh boy. Shadow kick is like five frames, dude. Round one. Fight. I hate that he can just get through all of this shit. Like, half my character is eliminated because Johnny Cage exists. Like, Shadow Kick just eliminates everything. It eliminates projectile. One grab. Finish him. Girls fatal will not work. I swear to God. <laughs> I keep trying to do it. Just R2 and Square. I never have issues with that stuff until today. I don't know if a patch changed that shit or what. You 
You got tethered. Oh no, you got tethered. Welcome to the world of unblockables, my friend. I don't think the match is impossible. I feel like Raiden is actually a worse matchup, which is weird, but I, that's just how, how it is in fighting games sometimes. Sometimes the top tier might not be your worst. I feel like Raiden, after fighting Raiden once, I was like, this is impossible. <laughs> this is not, this is, Havoc cannot beat Raiden, ever. Unless he teleports unsafe, there's no, there's never another opportunity to do damage on him. He just negates your wake up. Shadow kick negates half your shit. You have to respect the shadow kick because it's so fast. I just want a quality of life update. I feel like that's that should be the priority. Cause uh we didn't get no Omni Man gameplay but besides that one teaser still. And he's supposed to be coming out like soon. Cause he, they said November and I know uh pre orders get DLC like a week early. Havoc. Smoke. Cora. Sonya Blade. <laughs> Now go to the how go to the Halloween. Flesh bits. After Saito, no one respects you. No, go All to the Halloween map, please. It's Halloween. I have to play on the Halloween map. Fight. Oh my god. Okay. What? Why'd you do that? Uh, we both know that wasn't gonna hit. I jumped before he even did it. Round two. Fight. I guess I have to just block teleports. Oh no. I have to just block teleports in this matchup, I guess. Final round. Fight. Dead. I'm not dead. I 
would have waited. Ah, oh, fuck you. Finish him. Now I'm dead. I did the only option I had. <laughs> I knew the fatal wasn't good to kill. Smoke wins. Fuck. Round one. Fight. You, welcome to the mix, my good sir. Welcome to the blender. <laughs> he knows. Okay, I guess. No projectiles for me. No projectiles for me. I am the final round. Fight. <laughs> Go this way. Thank you. Finally, it's not the Goro Fatal, but the Havoc Fatal works. Fatality. Havoc wins. The hell? What is this dark blue palette? I actually got dragon crystals too, randomly. Round one, fight! Are you just teleporting randomly? Gotcha. That projectile goes around me, so you can't teleport there. Whoop. Oh, 
Okay, that's a punish. It doesn't work, man. I swear to God. <laughs> it's one fatal. I just can't get it today. It's all I want to do. All I want to do Round one, fight. is have some fun. Ouch. That's going to hurt. I walked right into that. Oh, you dropped it on the last hit! Yo, Goober! Fuck you! Stay in the corner. That's where I like you. Round two. Fight. No, I said go. No. No. Oh God. Oh no. Oh no. I did meter burn at the wrong time, I think. But we're not done yet. Okay, I saved. I have full bar though. Final round. Fight. Oh no. Nope, I have to cash out. I had to do that. I had to. There's no way you're this dumb. There's no way you're this dumb. There's no way. This game. You were mashing buttons and did not respect the fact that I had fatal. What a shame. You've made a mistake. I got more fatals. I got easy fatals. Round one, fight. I got fatal. Yeah, I don't like that. I can't use that move in this matchup. Like, every time I try to do it, it gets interrupted. I don't like that. Feels unfair. I'm not done yet. I'm not done yet. 
Nope. Okay, now I'm done. There's, uh, there's just matchups in this game where Havoc can't use projectile at all whatsoever. And this is one of them, apparently. Which sucks, because I need it. I need it for, like, the B&B. &B. Which this guy is blocked, so I, get, I can't really do it. You can't wake up there. <laughs> that is plus on hit, man. <laughs> you can't. You can't. You just have to duck. Duck or delay wake up is what you should do. Bad news. I'm blocking. Spicy. I respected that. I don't like the blender that you're trying to put me in, though. Spent a lot of meter in that round, man. Final round. Fight. What? Where'd your connection go? Uh oh. I was trying to do the back fist and sometimes it's not coming out. Like back one too, not coming out. Or is it just one two? That doesn't make sense. It might just be one two, right? Nope. 
Ah, he's learning. Uh oh, I'm not. I pressed the wrong button. Yeah. Oh! I tried to do a mix up there on Wake Up, but he expected something different. What's up, Ultra? Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate it. We're playing uh, Mortal Kombat. I am the Havoc, and uh, it's a smoke is a weird matchup for me. I can't really do anything against what he's doing except for Fuse Breaker. Oh boy, that's game. Shit. Can't use projectile. Fatality. And he knows he's learning the matchup as we're playing because he was doing things differently. Round one. Fight. <laughs> Let's try 4-4. Four, four. Ow. Or I mean 1-1. One, one. Uh-oh. He's invisible. Get out of here. The fatalities are ace. Uh, most of them are pretty good. Funny enough, I don't think this Mortal Kombat has the best fatalities. Oh no. No! I lost the tether. I lost the tether. I had the tether and I lost the tether. Facing the wrong way. That's kind of lame. That's really lame. Watch your back. Round two. Fight. It's 2-1. Is 2-1 what I need to be doing? 
not one two it's two one is the back fist smoke wins okay round one fight what fuck you bonk 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 toss you over there That's a grab. Woo! <laughs> I'm surprised that landed from that far away. I like moved backwards. That was so strange, dude. He's pressing a button. I don't know why. He like hit me with something and it like actually moved me backwards. It was very strange. I don't think it was supposed to do that. My heart goes out to you, bro. Much love. How's it going? Uh, this matchup is so awkward sometimes. It's such an uphill battle. Smoke is 100% offense. And they kind of nerfed Havoc's defense. So it makes it harder than it needs to be. We're playing Havoc Goro today. Yeah, much appreciate the raid from Ultra. Ultra always comes in clutch with the raid. He's a good friend of mine. He's been he's been playing a lot of stuff. He's a big fan of RPGs. I know he's uh, big into uh, some CD Projekt Red stuff. He's been going through like Witcher and Cyberpunk and stuff like that. It's always fun to watch. I'm also a fan of those things. I have not played Cyberpunk yet, though. It's on my list, I just... It's not, like, my priority. I will play Cyberpunk one day, in the future. Sub-Zero. Have Serena Goro. Like, I want to play it. I was going to play it Temple at release. And then all the <laughs> nonsense with it happened. And, the and I kind of was like, oh, I think I'll wait. And then I just happen. kept waiting and waiting and waiting. And it's got, and I'm glad that I have because it seems to be just getting better and better and better. This matchup, not so much of an issue. I, just, I still have to respect Ice Ball. Like, 
Like, I still have to respect his tools, but it's not that bad of a matchup. Uh-oh. Hey, guess what? <laughs> hey, guess what? That's all unblockable. All of it. <laughs> all of that shit is unblockable. Might be dead. Yep. Damn. Sub Zero wins. It was all going so well. Don't run away. Oh, he ran away. One and done. Baby status. Oh no. I jumped into the ice clone. That's my own fault. <laughs> yeah, you can tether into Goro and set it's a restand. It resets back into uh, unblockable. It's really dirty. That's what we just did to him, and I still lost the game, but it, I hit him with it, so. I'm happy that I at least got to hit it once today. Because it is broken. I feel like they gotta. I don't know how you fix that. I don't know why it's a restand. It makes no sense. The move is supposed to be a juggle, but sometimes. If you cancel stuff with Havoc, it restands instead of juggles. He's the only character that makes Goro do it. That's why I think this uh, cameo is really interesting for Havoc. Although I think Sub Zero is way better. Like, if you want the best, the best shit for Havoc, Sub Zero. Sub Zero is number one. Cyrax might be number two. Like, still, oh, yeah. even after the nerf. I think Cyrax is his second best game, yeah? The Great Hall. My realm's order won't be disrupted. You can't stop the revolution, Scorpion. Alright. No, we learned that I cannot throw Fireball one time in this matchup. Oh, God. I don't like that that goes through armor on the last part. Round two. Fight. Nope. Can't throw a projectile. I don't know why I tried to do it. Oh, 
Oh. The match is over. Thank you. I think this is a terrible matchup for Havoc, too. That went through the spear. What the fuck? Poke him. Poke him to death if I have to. Oh, you're so lucky. I was ducking, everybody saw it. I don't know if I would have went for that. Cause that's what happens when you do that. That breaks tether! Fuck! What is with all these moves breaking tether? That's so bullshit. That means I have to block after I did a full proper punish. Oh my god. This is gonna hurt. Oh! He opted not to do full combo. Why? Is he saving meter? For what? Why would you not do full combo? I was expecting full combo, he didn't do it. Maybe he was trying to carry damage over by extending the... but ended up dropping? No, no, because he did hard knockdown on the spear instead of just pulling it to him. He can pull you to the ground as like a hard knockdown for Oki. But if he just does regular spear, he can launch me and get full combo. It's like 45% damage he just left on the table. I don't understand why you would do that. 
It wasn't like a dropped combo, it was a weird decision by the player. Yeah. <laughs> Can't do that. I know better, I know. Put yourself in the corner. Again. Uh. See? See, he can do a full combo. He kind of did the start of it. It's what Scorpion's all. Scorpion has not changed in like 15 years. It's the same character doing the same shit. Nothing about this character has changed. Nothing. Same character doing the same moves for 15 years. Legacy Scorpion. The only differences in this game is he has a crazy long low. That's about the only thing that's new. And, well, he's got an air dash. Because of the way the game works. So I guess that he kind of needs that, though. Got chipped out. Round two. Fight. Still in the corner. Final round. Fight. Oh. Ouchie. Brutality. Have it. Have permission to die. Ouchies. He's jumping at me as if I'm not going to do anything. Havoc doesn't really have a good anti-air, but it still... There's uppercuts in the game. You... It's like... 
Or I could just backstep. <laughs> I guess. Like, what are you doing? I don't know why he's jumping at me so much. He doesn't need to. Like, you can't jump there. Why is he doing it? Goober. You're a big goober, dude. I've tried everywhere on the screen for Goro's fatality, and it has not worked one time. <laughs> it has not worked one time. Uh... Please! Round one. Fight! Happy, happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! Happy, 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 happy Halloween! Also, did you forget you have Serena, like, one, the best cameo in the game? What are you doing? Down one grab. Mortal Kombat, down one grab. You bitch. You had to. You had to. I mean, I get it. I know why you did it. into it. I might be dead because I, I did walk into this. Vic doesn't have a good anti-air, and Goro doesn't really give him that. So I just lose to free jump-ins. I think 
Tremor's gonna have that, though. I think Havoc and Tremor will work, because the only thing we know about Tremor is that he has an anti-air. That's all we know. When the Tremor cameo comes out with Omni-Man, he will have an anti-air. So at least one character, at least one cameo will have a true anti-air, besides Sonya. Because right now, it's like Sonya's the one you use if you really need an anti-air, which I do. Unfortunately, Sonya doesn't work with Havoc at all whatsoever. Is it? Uh, I was excited to play against a Shao, but he changed. I like fighting Shaos when I'm not Shao, but I hate mirror matches when I am Shao. I am well aware, Havoc. Right now, I just play Shao, Li Mei, and Havoc. I haven't really thought about a new character. At one point I wanted to play Liu Kang, but then I was like, eh, I think I'm gonna wait for Omni-Man to come out, and then I'll probably learn Omni-Man. Not that I care about the character, but I'm sure he'll be good, because DLC's always good when they first come out. Okay. No, Fatal Beats cameo. Sorry. Especially with that amount of health. If I had one HP, that might have worked, man. Fatal Blow! Okay. dead though I don't I don't know if I'm dead here yeah damn okay final round fight That didn't even hit me. Look how far away I was. What? That didn't even hit me. I was like half a screen away from that move. Huh? Okay. 
Yeah, whoever made Raiko's fatal grab. I don't know what you were thinking, man. Halloween Havoc time, boy. Johnny Cage. Hafino. Tomb of the Dragon Army. Tomb of the Dragon oh, Army. Mother, my face won't be the only thing you dread. Round one. Fight. Okay. I don't give a fuck. No, that still has three hits of armor. Round two. People said it didn't. It still does. I feel like they toned down the armor on the uh, the torso spin, not the arm rip. Yeah, that still is really good. It's the it's this. This doesn't have armor on startup anymore. It has armor like after you start spinning, which is weird. I guess so. It doesn't get interrupted. Maybe. I don't know. Don't be such a wimp. Final round. Fight. Go back there. Thank you. That's gonna hit. That's fine. He's got full meter though. Has opted not to use any of it this whole match. Doesn't need it. Johnny Cage. Okay. Finish him. Yeah, Kano's kind of cheap, huh? That laser goes through everything. That's why people are using Kano now more often. Vroom, vroom. You can't interrupt it. You can't do shit about it. I think you can duck it, but it's uh, it lasts forever. Not like you can crab walk underneath. If you leave now, it kind of makes you look like a wimp. And you left. Nobody wants to, like, actually play sets today. Mm -mm -mm.
Ding, 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 ding. One day we'll connect to a match. Is today the day? <laughs> 